subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi everyone, welcome to Test Prep Training. In this video you will learn about some commonly asked questions in Fortinet Network Security Professional NSE4. So let's get started. Question number 1. What files are sent to 40 Sandbox for inspection in flow-based inspection mode? Your options are A. All suspicious files that do not have their hash value in the 40 Guard Antivirus Signature Database B. All suspicious files that are above the defined oversize limit value in the protocol options C. All suspicious files that match patterns defined in the antivirus profile D. All suspicious files that are allowed to be submitted to 40 Sandbox in the antivirus profile The correct answer is, option C Question number 2 which statements about a one-to-one -one IP pool are true? Choose two. Your options are A. It is used for destination NAT B. It allows the fixed mapping of an internal address range to an external address range C. It does not use port address translation D. It allows the configuration of ARP replies The correct answers are, option C, and D. Question number 3, which of the following 40 gate configuration tasks will create a route in the policy route table? Choose 2. Your options are A. Static route created with a named address object B. Static route created with an internet services object C. SD-WAN route created for individual member interfaces D. SD-WAN rule created to route traffic based on link latency the correct answers are, option A, and D. Question number 4, a company needs to provide SSL VPN access to two user groups. The company also needs to display different welcome messages on the SSL VPN login screen for both user groups. What is required in the SSL VPN configuration to meet these requirements? Your options are, A different SSL VPN realms for each group. B2 separate SSL VPNs in different interfaces mapping the same SSL. Root. C2 firewall policies with different captive portals. D different virtual SSL VPN IP addresses for each group. The correct answer is option A. Question number 5. An administrator has configured central DNAT and virtual IPs. Which of the following can be selected in the firewall policy destination field? Your options are A. A VIP group B. The mapped IP address object of the VIP object C. A VIP object D. An IP pool The correct answer is, option C. Question number 6, which statement about 40 guard services for 40 gate is true? Your options are A. The web filtering database is downloaded locally on 40 gate. B antivirus signatures are downloaded locally on 40 gate. C 40 gate downloads IPS updates using UDP port 53 or 8888. D 40 analyzer can be configured as a local FDN to provide antivirus and IPS updates. The correct answer is option B. Question number 7. Which of the following route attributes must be equal for static routes to be eligible for equal cost multipath routing? Choose 2. Your options are A. Priority B. Metric C. Distance D. Cost The correct answers are, option A, and C. Question number 8, which statement is true regarding the policy ID number of a firewall policy? Your options are A defines the order in which rules are processed B represents the number of objects used in the firewall policy C required to modify a firewall policy using the CLI D changes when firewall policies are reordered The correct answer is, option C Question number 9, which statement is true regarding SSL VPN timers? Choose 2 Your options are a. Allow to mitigate DOS attacks from partial HTTP requests. B. SSL VPN settings do not have customizable timers. C. Disconnect idle SSL VPN users when a firewall policy authentication timeout occurs. D. Prevent SSL VPN users from being logged out because of high network latency. 
The correct answer is, option A. Question number 10, which of the following conditions must be met in order for a web browser to trust a web server certificate signed by a third party CA? Your options are A. The public key of the web server certificate must be installed on the browser. B. The web server certificate must be installed on the browser. C. The CA certificate that signed the web server certificate must be installed on the browser. D. The private key of the CA certificate that signed the browser certificate must be installed on the browser. The correct answer is, option C. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.